Hey, I'm Lights, and we're hanging out here at the shelter with Windsor Independent. Mm -hmm. Cool. So, um, how's tour going so far, and is there any highlights that you can remember? Oh, to tour is amazing. This is like hands down my favorite set we've ever done. I think, I think it's because at this point we're able to play a little bit of every record. It's not like we're specifically touring on Little Machines or on Siberia. So there's like this crazy dynamic in it and it's a journey through the past six years of my life. Plus we, have, we do this acoustic section in the middle because we actually just recorded an acoustic version of Little Machines. So and it's, it's just really special. Like every moment is valuable during this set so it flies by. And, and so every night's been amazing but I mean I don't know, there's been some really killer ones, like Boston's always insane, like Boston was really fun, New York was really fun, um, I think every show's been good, but, and, and all the other bands are amazing. What's your favorite song on this tour? This tour, actually, we started playing a bonus track, because, I mean, typically, we have so many songs that I never really get to the bonus tracks live, but this time around, I put three bonus tracks with Little Machines, and like, fans seem to really like them. So I took to Twitter to find out from people what they wanted to hear and we kind of like figured out what bonus track people wanted to hear the most. So we're playing From All Sides, which um, is this crazy dynamic song. It's got, it's got electro in it. It's got like, like old school rock and roll sounding guitar riffs and stuff. And it's just so much fun. And we kind of opened the set with it and it's really epic. And I had not anticipated that song being that epic live, but it's been really fun doing that one. Good. And uh, while on the road, what makes you feel at home? <sighs> Being on the road, I guess the one thing that really makes you feel at home is the people that are around you. I think you always have to surround yourself with people that you love. Um, if there's any amount of negativity on the road, if somebody like is in the sort of spirit of bringing people down, it's viral on the road. So you have to make sure you're with family. And I mean, I'm lucky enough that I get to tour with family a lot, which which makes it easier. But um, that would be the, the the number one thing because when you're on tour, you just miss you miss home, and when you can bring a little bit home. Yeah, she comes nice. literally everyone. It's like her eighth tour, this one. Wow. Yeah, we've been going straight since she came out. <laughs> so do you think you're ever going to like, not push her in the direction of music, but kind of like, like, hey, check out what my daughter's going to go with I mean, she's around it all the time. She's literally in the music industry. She knows exactly what happens, so I don't have to push her in any kind of direction when it comes to that. I'll let her decide. I mean, she may very well decide she doesn't want to do music because she's seen how it is and how unglamorous it is. <laughs> you know, a lot of people have these like misconceptions about the industry and you know, there's stars in your eyes and that's what motivates people to get into the industry, but it's not like that. <laughs> and so if you can see the dirt and the grime behind the scenes and how I'm in like a scuzzy bathroom sitting on the toilet doing my hair, um, she may not want to get into it. <laughs> uh, and what advice would you give up and coming Canadian artists trying to make it into the industry? First of all, if you're a uh, Canadian artist that's trying to make it, you're very lucky because Canada has a great infrastructure for for artists and supporting the arts. I mean, I've had so much support from the systems that we have in place to keep Canadian music alive, and I think that we're seeing it thrive across the world right now, and it's amazing. So you're, it's a good time to be a Canadian music, musician. Yes. First, consider yourself lucky. <laughs> Second, um, figure out what it is you do best, and then put it out. I wouldn't just put out a mishmash of a variety of things that you do, because people won't understand it. And if, if somebody happens to scoop you up, and try to make you into something, they're gonna make you something you aren't. So figure out your place in music, figure out who you are, spend some time on self-discovery and understanding what you love about music, and then put it out there and people will find it, I promise you that. I spent so many years finding the, the genre that I am now. I was in like a metal band, and I was in um, like a rock and roll band, and I was doing like screamo stuff for a while, and then I was doing acoustic stuff, and then piano rock and I just literally tried everything and got really weird for a while until I finally settled upon the music that I am and then started my MySpace page. Now there's other things, other ways now you can put your music out, YouTube, Twitter, there's literally, you have every avenue open to you so just figure out your spot and put it out. Um, what female artist in the industry inspires you most? American or Canadian? Oh my goodness. Or worldwide? Well I think in terms of like long-standing ladies that have always influenced me. I think it's like Joni Mitchell, Patti Smith, Kate Bush, um, Bjork. Just like innovative and confident and like have their own thing going and, and are great songwriters and great storytellers. And I think that's been such an inspiration to me over the years to just be my own artist and do it well. And um, what, last question, what's next for Lights? I haven't, I don't, we don't have a release date for this or anything yet, but um, we just finished 
an acoustic version of Little Machines, and there's two unreleased tracks on it as well. And it's like one of the most beautiful things I think I've ever made. So keep your ears peeled for that in a few months because that'll be out. And probably lots more touring <laughs> like ceaseless. Cool. Right. Cut, that's it. Awesome. Yeah. Thank you guys. No